Hello, what's up, what's up, and welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Today we got another Through the Years, Demarius Thomas. Now, this, I know it's not his number, but they only have so many numbers to go out in this game, and a lot of times freshmen are not going to have their right number, but I believe this is him. His measurables add up where he's from, kind of adds up. It's not perfect, but it kind of adds up, and I'm thinking if he's a high enough recruit, He's probably going to be in the game as a freshman. The number, again, might not add up. And a lot of times during spring ball, they don't have the number that they're going to wear during the fall season. So I'm going to say that this is him. I could be wrong, but I'm going to say this is him. 76 overall for his freshman year. 87 speed for Demarius Thomas. 88 agility. 65 strength. He also came in with a 59 awareness, 65 break tackle, 91 elusiveness, 88 for his juke move, 72 spectacular catch, 74 catch in traffic, 78 for his overall catch, 82 route running, and a 90 jump rating. He will catch 35 passes for 580, 558 yards, excuse me, and four TDs. For his sophomore season here in NCAA 07, 81 overall, 86 for his speed. He also came in with 89 agility, 88 acceleration, 66 awareness, 86 elusiveness, 93 for that juke move, 85 catch, 78 spectacular catch, 77 catch in traffic. Route running was at 87, and his jumping ability was at 9. And two, he would catch 39 passes for 627 yards plus three TDs. NCAA 2010, he is 88 overall with 88 speed, 89 agility, 89 acceleration, 76 awareness, 72 elusiveness, 86 catch, 85 spectacular catch, 87 catch in traffic, 88 route running, and a 92 jump rating. He will haul in 46 passes for 1,154 yards. That average had to be stupid. And then eight TDs as well. His average overall was 81.6. He'll be drafted in the first round to the Denver Broncos ahead of Des Bryant. I don't know if that was the right move. I don't know if that was the wrong move. All I know is that was the move that they went with. As a rookie, he comes in at 74 overall with 96 speed, 91 agility, 87 acceleration, 55 awareness, 65 elusiveness, 85 juke move, 84 catch. 54 for his route running, 77 catch in traffic, 87 for his spectacular catch, 88 beat press, 95 jump rating. He would catch 22 passes for 283 yards and two TDs his rookie season. Year number two, he's 73 overall, went down just a little bit, 96 speed, 91, 91 agility, 92 acceleration, 55 awareness, 65 elusiveness, 88 for that juke move, 81 catch, 59 route running. 78 for that catch in traffic, 87 spectacular catch, 95 jump in the 85 beat press. Now his elusiveness rating is going to stay at 65, so I'm just not going to say that no more. 65, right? He caught 32 passes, 551 yards, and 4 TDs his sophomore season in the NFL. Moving on to his third year, he has a new quarterback, and he should be a beast, right? He is 81 overall in this game, 96 speed, 92 agility, 92 acceleration, 70 awareness, he also comes in with an 85 juke move, 82 or 85 for his catching as well, 73 route running, 88 spectacular uh, catch. He also came in with a 92 beat press rating and a 95 jump. Okay, Peyton Manning was his quarterback, so his numbers improved. 94 catches, 1,434 yards and 10 TDs. Madden 25, he is 93 overall. He is in the 90 club. 96 speed, 93 agility, 94 acceleration, 89 awareness, and yes, his looseness is still 65. 85 for his juke move, 94 for his catch, 91 catch in traffic, 94 spectacular catch, 95 beat press, and then he also comes in with a 95 for his jump. He would catch a grand total of 92 passes for 1,430 yards and 14 TDs. Absolute beast. An absolute beast. Madden 15, 95 overall, 96 speed for Demarius Thomas, 94 agility, 94 acceleration, 88 awareness, 65 elusiveness, 85 for that juke move, 94 for that catch, 94 route running, 92 catch in traffic, 95 spectacular catch, and a 97 beat press with a 95 jump rating as well. This will be his best year in the NFL. He caught 111 passes for 1,619 yards and 11 TDs. Madden 16, he comes in with a rating of 93 overall, 90 
for his speed, 94 agility. How does he go down after having his best season? I don't know. It must have something to do with the mechanics of the game. That's what I'm thinking. 94 agility, 92 acceleration, 88 awareness, 85 juke move, 94 catch, 94 route running, 92 uh, catch in traffic, 95 spectacular catch, 97 beat press, and 95 jump. He will catch 105 passes this season for 1,304 yards, and he will tack on six TDs. The man could get it in. The man could get it done. Let's move right along to Madden 17. And in Madden 17, Demarius Thomas, he will come in at 94 overall. 91 for his speed. 94 agility. 92 acceleration. 88 awareness. 84 juke move. 86 for his catching. 90 for his route running. 92 for his catch in traffic. 94 spectacular catch. 95 beat press. And he will come in with a 90 five jump yet again he will haul in 90 passes this season for 1083 yards and five tds and this will be his last season crossing the 1000 yard receiving barrier madden 18 he comes in at 87 overall so that overall starting to dip back into the 80s 91 speed 92 acceleration 90 awareness 84 juke move 83 catching he also comes in with an 89 route running, 89 catch in traffic. He comes in with a 94 spectacular catch and a 92 overall jump rating. When we look at his stats, he will catch 83 passes for 949 yards and 5 TDs. So at this point, he is starting to dip. Just a little bit, just a little bit. In Madden 19, he would start off with the Denver Broncos, but he would finish with those Houston Texans. I mean, if this was like Madden 17, him and D-Hop, that actually might be a great combo, but it wasn't. It's Madden 19, and his skills are starting to decline just a little bit. But in Madden 19, he's 88 overall. 91 speed, 94 agility, 91 acceleration, 92 awareness, 70 break tackle, 86 for that juke, 87 catch, 89 catch in traffic, 93 spectacular catch, 86 short route running, 85 medium route running, and an 83 deep route running. He will catch 59 passes between the Broncos and the Texans for 677 yards and 5 TDs. So again... He was a decent receiver at this point. Probably still one of the better ones, but I don't know what was going on with my man. Anyways, Madden 20, he would start off on the Patriots roster, but he would end up on the Jets. I believe right before the season started, they traded him from the Patriots to the Jets. So anyways, man, 82 overall for Madden 20, 90 speed, 89 acceleration, 86 awareness, 70 break tackle, 85 for that juke move, 83 catch, 85 for his short route running, 84 for his medium route running, 81 for his deep route running, 87 catch in traffic and a 92 spectacular catch. He would call in 36 passes for 433 yards and one TD. Now, I did not find him in Madden 21, and I believe I still have the default roster. I could not find him. So I don't know if he was a free agent at some point in the game or not, but I couldn't find him in my copy. So throughout all the Maddens that I have him in, 86 overall is his average overall. That's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope that the rest of your day is the best of your day. Peace. Love. Hot sauce.